My name is Cannabis Rollins. My journey is beginning. A journey that I hope will open the doors of life to me and link my past with my future. A journey that will bring me to a strange and dark place. From Hammerfell to Skyrim to a house called Rollinwood. A world that I have never known with people I have never met. People who tonight are still only shadows in my mind, but who will soon fill the days and nights of my tomorrow. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. It's time for me to turn my attention back to the Dawn Guard problem. I'm here, in the middle of a wasteland, a frozen wasteland, looking for Septimus Cygnus. outpost. Out in the middle of nowhere. But the College of Winterhold is close by. All right, it's time to see who this Septimus Cygnus is. Bandit, you caught up with me. Good. When the top level was built, eh? no more could be placed. It was and is the maximal apex. I heard you know about Elder Scrolls. Elder Scrolls, indeed. The Empire, they absconded with them. Or so they think. The ones they saw. <laughs> the ones they thought they saw. I know of one. Forgotten. Sequestered. But I cannot go to it, not poor Septimus, for I, I have arisen beyond its grasp. So, where is the scroll? Here. What? Well, here as in this plain. Mondas, Tamriel, nearby, relatively speaking. <laughs> On the cosmological scale, well, it's all nearby. Can you help me get the Elder Scroll or not? One block lifts the other. Septimus will give what you want, but you must bring him something in return. And what do you want? You see this masterwork of the Dwemer. Deep inside their greatest knowings. Septimus is clever among men, but he is but an idiot child compared to the dullest of the Dwemer. Lucky then they left behind their own way of reading the Elder Scrolls. In the depths of Black Reach, one yet lies. Have you heard of Black Reach? Cast upon where Dwemer City slept. The yearning spire, hidden learnings kept. <laughs> mm, nice rhyme scheme. Where is this black reach? Under deep, below the dark, the hidden keep, Tower Mzark. <laughs> of Pan, the point of puncture, a first entry of the tapping. No rough stuff. Just take it. Delve to its limits. And Black Reach lies just beyond. But not all can enter there. 
Only Septimus knows the hidden key to loose the lock to jump beneath the deathly rock. <laughs> you and your rhymes. So, how do I get in? Two things I have for you. Two shapes. One edged, one round. The round one for tuning. Dwemer music is soft and subtle, and needed to open their cleverest gates. The edged lexicon for inscribing. To us, a hunk of metal. To the Dwemer, a full library of knowings, but empty. Find the Zark and its sky dome. The machinations there will read the scroll and lay the lore upon the cube. Trust Septimus. He knows you can know. All right. So what do I do with this sphere? The deepest doors of Dwemer listen for singing. It plays the attitude of notes proper for opening. Can you not hear it? Too low for hearing? And what do I do with this cube? To glimpse the world inside an Elder Scroll can damage the eyes or the mind as it has to Septimus. I'm glad you realize the that. Found a loophole as they always do. To focus the knowledge away and inside without harm. Place the lexicon into their contraption and focus the knowings into it. When it brims with glow, bring it back and Septimus can read once more. And what do you want with an Elder Scroll? Ooh, an observant one. How clever to ask of Septimus. This Dwemer lockbox, look upon it and wonder. Inside is the heart, the heart of a god, the heart of you and me. But it was hidden away, not by the dwarves, you see. They were already gone. Someone else, unseen, unknown, found the heart, and with a flair for the ironical, Use dwarven trickery to lock it away. The scroll will give the deep vision needed to open it. For not even the strongest machinations of the Dwemer can hold off the all sight given by an Elder Scroll. All right. That will be all. Fire salts. I'd better not steal them in his presence. I don't want to do anything to affect our alliance. Come on, bandit, let's go. this take us next? Alftan. Hmm, Sarthal. Driftshade Refuge. Suppose Sarthal is closest. What's going on now? Behind you. Just a scratch. Can't win this. <laughs> I didn't realize.
surprise the bats have actually carried them aloft. Start keeping a knife in my boot. I'm tired of getting disowned. Okay, let's go. With this fresh supply of blood, I should be able to stand the sunlight now. Go to the college, Do your smarts. Like I'm supposed to figure out which college he meant. You are supposed to figure it out. Someone over there. Here we are at Alftan. Oh no, I hear explosions. Feed me, me. Kill him to get some beer every now and then. Stupid. Oh, look at this. Some sort of fight. who they are. Ignore them. You're the troublemaker. <laughs> oh, the bats must have carried you further than could have been expected. do we have here? A bandit. <laughs> Die to give myself up.
Let's go. Looks like it's this way, Bandit. All this. I known she was mine. She said she'd wait for me. Ah, but they never wait. Lots of blood. Where is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Chizar. You always try to keep it for yourself. And I'm gonna start keeping a knife in the boot. Tired of getting disowned. Voices are gone, or at least the voice. Ah, never enough gold. Just need one good haul. Search this. Soul gems. A dropped torch. Search notes. Oh, this is a lot of reading, it looks like. If only Umana would have left one of these dwarven machine creatures intact for me to study. The fact that they almost killed those Khajiit brothers in the middle of the night doesn't mean we couldn't have found a way to disable one. We dragged some stuff in front of the pipes they came out of to stop them from coming back. They are simply fascinating. It's just as Calselmo described, or Calcimo as some people say, in Dwarves Volume 2. Their appearance does in fact resemble that of an arachnid. I had thought that to be an embellishment given by his source. 
The inclusion of the soul gem into the design of the apparatus is quite remarkable. It could explain the focus for the lightning that he describes. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear to be the main power source for the apparatus. Perhaps some sort of harmonic resonance with the energies contained in the soul gem to bring heat to a small boiler. Too early to say conclusively, that does raise the question of where they get the liquid for the boiler, however. Huh? That was strange. I thought I just saw something moving around beyond the barred door. It looked vaguely humanoid. I wonder if it could be an undiscovered automaton. I'm going to move my bedroll down here to see if I can catch another glimpse of it. This is all so exciting. So, well, whatever it was, looks like it killed the person. I don't see a way to get past this door. I imagine it may have been opened from the other side. And the creature came in. Alright, I think we need to go up this way. I think this drop torch is trying to tell us something. This way, another drop torch. I'm just seeing if you're all right. I was just electrified. Another drop torch were being led as though these were breadcrumbs. What? Who is this brother? Really? Another of the smooth skins looking for food? A Khajiit. I'm sorry. You're just way too slow. <laughs> um. Ah, here's this corpse. All right, here's Jazar's journal. This one is at his wit's end. I signed Jadar and myself up for this expedition to try to keep, to get him clean of skooma. I bought a small supply to try to bring him down slowly, but the storm has had us trapped in the glacier for weeks. The others have not yet caught on that one with fur should not shake so much from the cold but I've run out of the little skooma I brought, and Jadar is getting pretty bad. He started hallucinating creatures coming out of the ice and the ruins. The others are starting to think he may be behind Valley's disappearance, but I know he would never do something like that. All right, bandit.
sure what to expect. Ah. Watch out, something's shooting. Try my healing. Keep forgetting about this. Like a black soul gem just lying around. Nothing like having locked chests behind locked doors. Boots of the Dragon. Hmm. Take the boots. Must be the way. Hmm, look out. Much too slow. Was not for show. Someone had to die. Come on, come on. Slow down there, bandit.
Stay on guard. There's no telling when the next spider will jump out at us. Look at this. Now it's a good thing I completed my training with the Thieves Guild. Down there, bandit, I have it. Under control. Already handled. Bandit, where are you? Get through the best you can. Something else is in here. I'm not sure what is this. No, it's not that. Our next stop is the Alftan Amamunchlorine. Amamunchlorine. Alftan Amamunchlorine. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say, Bandit. Let's go.